It's March 8th, uh, 2023. I was uh, invited to Bible study by somebody at Zion Church um, who alerted me that it was going on. Again, I don't use the computer. I don't use email. I don't, I'm not using any of that stuff. I have no need for it. I have no desire for it. I don't want to sit in front of a machine for hours just staring into like a screen that hurts my eyes. I have no interest in any of this stuff. Never did. Um, but yet that's the way that the New York society or area has forced. I mean, it's, it's almost as if you don't use a computer, you can't even survive. Well, I know how to use a computer, but again, it's part of the problem living here. Um, so now I'm on the computer looking for the link and I clicked on their e-news, which normally I wouldn't even look for because I'm, I'm just, I'm not doing this internet thing. It's bad for my eyes. It's bad for a whole lot of things and it's discriminatory that everything is now, I mean, I go to church every Sunday. I've made it very clear that I do not participate with a computer, that I'm in the service. I go for social security. I go for social interaction at the local Zion Episcopal Church. Now, here we are. Here's their administrator who's now leaving and going to Long Island. This is what I find out on the newsletter. I go down. And then they've got this cup of life thing. Only thing that I've heard them mention inside the um, inside where I go uh, for the social part was this cup of life on Thursdays, um, which they're just starting up. And as I scroll down, they, they talk about this little light uh, service. I scroll down. I have not heard them make any mention of this particular service. It's called Make Sure You Come to Queens Community Land Act Town Hall. It said, two, I missed it. It was yesterday, not today. Today's Bible study. Um, and it was in Jackson Heights. So that would have been a schlep and a bit of a problem, but I most likely would have gone to figure out what this was. Um, it says Zion members will, will whatever his name is, is one of the organizers of a town hall to discuss community land trusts. I have no idea what that is. It says the Community Land Act, a package of New York City bills that will help CLTs acquire land, take it off the speculative market, and build deeply and permanently affordable housing and community spaces. Uh, Father Carl's going to attend if you'd like to join him and will at this meeting. So I would have liked to have gone, but nobody alerted me that this was even a possibility. It only exists in some cyberspace. And then with a social aspect, but even going to the physical meetings of social interaction with other humans in my area, it's discriminatory practices for certain. Not, I mean, I'm in a church hall and they're not alerting me that this level of community education exists for what reason? And how are they even like authorized to discriminate against me in this social setting? This makes absolutely no sense whatsoever. Again, I sit at superposition in like astronomical terms. So I know I'm purposely being discriminated against. It, it's kind of obvious. But here we are. Um, it's just how it feels New York's conducted itself 
certainly since 1995, 96, when I had a problem in the same area, in the same house, after being forced out of the Glen and coming back this way. Um, as far as derailments are going. Um, so I just find it incredibly disturbing that now everything, like, no longer is there, like, personal contacts of, hey, here's something you might be interested in, not sure. I mean, that's the way it used to be in an all-inclusive community. But there's stuff going on that's not even inclusive. And, I mean, again, this is just how New York's been conducting itself since I arrived in 1978. It's like they decide somehow when and how they'll participate. Um, it doesn't work that way at the G.O.D. level. It's star 1978, star 8378. Nicole Ketterosite's Earth Solar System Milky Way Universe Galaxy is broken. And it's Bayside Station, Bayside, New York, 11361. 